there. Hi guys, would you like to introduce yourselves? My name is David. And I'm Ryan. And we've been together five years. And yes. married for two years. <laughs> married for yeah two years yes almost two years this coming august so all right the rules are simple whoever picks a question will ask it the other person will answer and please answer as honestly as you can i'll try <laughs> <laughs> okay we'll start off with the first question now i'm gonna go first so I'll read the question and then you answer. Okay. What does a happy and healthy relationship look like to you? It looks like us. Yeah. <laughs> happy and healthy relationship, I think, is a relationship that continually grows um, together and individually. So, parang sa atin. Now, being in a relationship, you become a better person. You know. What is something small that we can do daily for each other to make our lives better? Oh my god. Something small? Yeah. That we can do daily? Just saying I love you every day. But we always do that. Kaya nga, what is something small diba? Yeah. that we can do every day? <laughs> Akala ko sasabihin mo, you should start washing the dishes. <laughs> Pero hindi, I think we're doing it already. Every day. Kaya nga tayo naka 5 years na diba? Yee! Chusera! Chusera. <laughs> what is something I did that you thought was exceptionally kind or thoughtful? Thoughtful? Um, madami eh. Sama lang yung hero. <laughs> Pinagalitan <laughs> pa ako. Salam. Kind and thoughtful that you did is kasi syempre, um with each other's personalities, I'm the one who's um, emotional. So, so um, when I have those moody and gloomy days, he makes time to bring me chocolates yes. and just sit beside me in bed and just hug me and shower me with butterfly kisses. Oh, gondo! Pero minsan, diba? Dead ma lang sa'yo. <laughs> Ako na! Baka may sabihin ka pang mali! <laughs> Is it really necessary to know everything from your partner's previous relationships? I think yes. Diba? Although, um... Uh, hate ko kasi yung pinag-uusapan yung past, in, to be honest. Um, pero, I think uh, it actually helps uh, the future, yung present tsaka future relationship. Yeah. Kasi, parang we learn, no? I also learn from what uh, his experiences are, no? from the past relationship. So, uh, and from there, alam ko kung ano yung naging struggle niya. So, at least ako, alam ko na kung paano kayo mamanage or yan. Yeah. What I don't like though is maging French sex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those are the those, that is one of the things that we don't agree on. Sha, he doesn't agree yes. that you should be friends with exes. He he doesn't believe that exes should be friends. Ako naman I do. I also believe because depende sa intention. Knowing about uh, your partner's previous relationship depende sa intention mo. Why do you wanna know? Because if your intention is, for example, you want to know so that you can love your partner better and ano yung mga nasa previous relationship that worked or ano yung mga hindi nag work so that you can also work on your current relationship, that's a good thing. That's a healthy thing. Because again, just like what we said kanina, you need to grow yes. together. Pero di ba siya nagtanong? So, 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 tanong niya, sagot niya. <laughs> Makuda. Damo <laughs> kuda. <laughs> oh, ah, ikaw pala. Ano Okay. When was the last time you said I love you to me? Diba? Uh, always, every single day. So, kailan? Anong oras? Anong date? Kanina, morning. Talaga? Alam you, man. Ganon. Ano to? Every single day and yes. throughout the day. Yes. I have a follow up question with a why though. Why do you say that always, every day? Some people think that it's 
um, it's it shouldn't be done uh, a lot because baka daw magsawa or baka maging routine na lang yung pagsabi. Exactly. But I think that depends on person to person or relationship to relationship. Sa amin kasi, we like it. And it, it, it brightens the day. And I like the feeling, personality, especially ko, I like it when someone tells me I love you. And ako din, personality ko, mahilig ako mag-appreciate and mahilig ako mag-express ng love. Kaya Totoo so, yun. Yeah. Very expressive niya. And it, uh, it helps the relationship too, no? Kasi, I mean, when you say I love you, parang you kind of feel, uh, you kind of feel so special. Diba? See, so, every day, parang, imagine that. Imagine every mo day. you wake up the morning and then someone will say I love you. It brightens up your day. At tapos, syempre, it has a domino effect in a way from morning till night, diba? You feel very You can wash um, the dishes happy, morning till diba? night. Yan. Yes. Oh, say it nga. I love you. Nya too. <laughs> what are some things you really like about me? Some things. Oh, are you seen more? Pati bang you don't like? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Something I like. Number one, she's pretty, de ba? Ang galing galing yung singer. So kung kumakanta siya, may love ako to. Dun number ako one fan. So number yes. one fan niya ako. Yun yung pinaka ng gusto ko sa kanya. And number two is that sobrang caring niya. Like she will, she will always. She? Ah, Ay, she ka ba? Tika sorry. He. Got it done. At saka he always makes me feel loved. Yun yung gustong gusto ko. And he never, ano, hindi siya nagsasawa. Diba? Walang, ch- walang, ano, walang chemi yun. <laughs> what do you think is the most essential thing in a successful relationship? I think parang nasagot ko na rin yan kanina. It, um, it means, uh, essential thing is growth. And it should be always in everything mutual. Growth should be both sides. Learning should be both sides. Fighting and fighting for the relationships of both should be both sides. Because at any point, if only one partner is growing or only one partner is learning and only one partner is fighting for the relationship, it's bound to fail. It has to be both of you have to want it. Serious, uh, right? Serious, so darling, good. Miss Universe. Miss Universe. <laughs> How realistic do you think couples in movies and TV are? In movies and TV, is it realistic to real life relationships? Is there any uh, show or movie na you can relate to us or you think reflects us? Parang kayo? Ah, ganun ba? Um, teka lang, hiya kong tanong. Ang dami kasing movies or TV. Um, teka lang. Ano? Um, pwede rin. Huh? <laughs> Kuna lang kayo sumabot. <laughs> Hindi <laughs> sabi niya kasi yung How to Get Away with Murder kasi di ba nandun si si um, What's his name? si uh, ano si Oliver si Oliver at saka si, si um What's his name? <laughs> Crush ko pa naman yun Ako din Si Oliver at saka si My God, I forgot the name Ah yung yeah, yun, I remember Basta yun yes. Hindi, <laughs> teka lang, kinala ko yun eh Si Oliver and um <laughs> Kalimutan mo po Anyway, so yun anyway, yun. yun. Yeah. So yun, kasi di ba si, ano daw, si Oliver medyo uh, uh, hacker, gigigiki, mag, uh, gano'n, di ba? Tapos si, si yung isang guy is ano, sobrang emotional, dramatic, so siya yun, di ba? Obviously, siya, siya, siya kasi yung artist, no? Ako kasi, uh, right side of uh, the brain siya, ako left side of the brain. Yeah. So, 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 Pero, <laughs> ano, yun ang maganda, di ba? Opposite at track. Yes. So, I think we're working on it well, and sabi niya kanina, we're learning and growing from each other. So, yes, mga, okay. nagagamit ko yung mga right side of the brain niya, siya na nagagamit sa akin yung left side of the brain. Thank you. Diba? What adventure would you like to go on with me? Oh. Yung hindi pa natin nagawa, ha? Ah, uh, I want to see Aurora Borealis the Northern Lights with you. Mm, yes, gusto ko rin yun. Kung may budget, wala kang budget. <laughs> Correct. Wala pang, wala pang fight na yun. In what areas do you think our personalities complement each other? Hindi ko alam eh, kasi... Siguro yung sagot ko kayo na yung right side of the brain mo, tapos right side of my yeah. the brain, diba sa akin? In a way, kahit na magkaiba, nagko-complement pa rin. Kasi ito mo, imagine mo, siya diba, artist siya, ano, Okay. Ano siya, makakalat siya. Pero ako, mahilig akong mag-glinis. As in, nag-enjoy ako. Nakakatanggal yes. ng stress. So kahit pa paano, yung personality niya yun, nagkakaulaman sa akin kasi habang nagkakalat siya akong naglinis, wala siyang pakailam. Dead ma siya. What do you think our life will look like in 10 years? Um, 
May bahay tayo. And we're living in the house. Siyempre, <laughs> may bahay kasi hindi titira ka, di ba? Gagansili. <laughs> <laughs> Tapos, hopefully, ako, I really want a, um, a baby, baby, baby boy. <laughs> I want a child. I want a child. I want our own son. Yes, in the future. In the future. Sa- and if, it, if it's something that um, we'll be blessed with, so why not? Yes. So, kind of like a happy family in the future. Yes. What's your favorite gift I've given you? Favorite gift na binigay mo sa akin? Ano ba? <laughs> uh, siguro yung relo. Yeah. Yung gold you know watch. why? I've given him so given him so many gifts, flowers, stuff, toys. Uh-oh. Hindi siya mahilig sa ganon because he likes practicality gifts that he can use. Okay. Emily ako sa watch. No? Uh-huh. Dati yon. So watch. Appreciate na kasi magagamit. As in, yeah. damage yun, no? So ginagamit niya sa office. Eh, wala pa akong gold watch. So binigyan niya ako ng gold watch. Yun yung pinaka favorite ko. Kasi anis ako sa kanya. Pag sinasabi ko, hindi mo kung bibili ng flowers at stuff toys. Kasi di ko talaga gusto. Yeah. Di ko alam ma. Aalika bukin lang. Uh-huh. <laughs> Oh, the ba? So hindi practical. Practical na tao kasi ako. Bigyan kita isang sakong bigas. <laughs> Pwede. Why not, the ba? Black rice. Mamaya bumili ka. Gusto ko black rice, yes. So shall. What do you think is the hardest thing about marriage being in a relationship? Hardest thing. It's hard to answer kasi sa kung sa atin I think life has been easier when because of you, because of being with you. Because uh, in the storms are easier, um, easier battled because I have you. For in yung sa question na in general, bale in uh, marriage and relationships, um, knowing because uh, you're always growing and knowing each other. So I think the the most challenging part is when you see the dark parts of a, of a person. As you stay together and grow together, you will always see dark parts. And when you see those dark parts, dark parts, you're always faced with a decision: Do you, do I accept this? Do I embrace this? Or do I let go? Ganon. Ano ba ano den? Kasi sa mga tibang hirap imaris pag, for example, yung pag nagtatalo kayo, nagawa kayo, may selosan, de ba ganon? I think that's really the hard part, especially yes. kapag halimbawa um, yung personality ng tao sobrang seloso or what na ba? That's how do you manage that? Tapos nagaawe kayo or what? Yon. Kaya ito ibang decision na kita eh. because they don't talk about it. The problems they have or what? So yeah. I think it's very important. What Thank is you. our greatest strength as a couple? Definitely communication. Yun yung pinaka importante. Lagi kami nag-uusap. And um, Actually, yeah. and um, hindi ako na tutulog sa gabi ng pag nagaawe kami. Na hindi kami nag-uusap or what? Kasi hirap itulog pag nagaawe. So for me, napaka importante yung step namin is we always we always are transparent to each other and we com- we have an open communication. Kasi if wala yun, mm. baka mag-fail yung relationship. I have this side in my personality that I am avoidant uh, avoidant of issues and yes. I try to run away. But he's the type na he's the he's a type of leader in a relationship that would just sit me down and talk and really um, make sure that we talk. Hindi pwedeng hindi tayo mag-usap. And I've learned a lot from him because of that. Kasi pero nung una kasi personality niya is pag nag-aaway kami or what, umaalis yan. So nung una hindi ko pa alam gagawin ko, 'di ba? Uh, my type of personality, pag ako ay nagii-emotional, uh, I can say a lot of things that are wrong and I can be hurtful with my words and I can um, I can go out of control. So because I love him, I would rather go away, stay away. And then he gets that that's why I'm angry. And then when I'm calm, when I'm back, we'll talk. Correct. Because he's not confrontational. Yeah. Especially when we're fresh and fresh issues. Petty issues, by the way. But I'm willing to buy it for him. Why? Because I'm good. No. Because I'm not good. 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 Because I'm ako kasi medyo meron ako meron akong tendency na parang parang naiisip ko pa rin pero after yun nga pag nag-uusap naman kami mabilis na rin nawawala What was your first impression about me? Nice. Maamo <laughs> Maamo When I first met you and we first started talking and everything you didn't you didn't have that imposing personality or even na- e- not even narcissism wala talagang traits he's very very maamo like a sheep 
um, yeah, and he's very nice, and he's very calm, and he's, yun lang, he's friendly, and I liked talking to you. And I think that was a good sign kasi five years, and we're still, we still like to talk to each other and talk about so many things, everything. Yes, everything under the sun. Yeah. So I remember ko talaga sa balko yun ang kodo, tapos nag-wine, and then she kahit yeah. Yeah, tapos sinititigan mo ako kasi ang ganda ko. Huh? What question should your should partners ask each other before getting married? Ay, ang hirap ng tanong. Hindi ko alam eh, pero tinanong ba kita nung nagpakasal tayo? I think, ano siya? Tinanong mo lang ako, are you ready? Hindi, uh, <laughs> actually, ikaw nga yun. Ikaw nga nag-propose, diba? Giselle. Anyway, ganda ko, diba? <laughs> <laughs> hindi, pero ano, um, nung nag-propose siya sa akin, hindi agad namin, um, I think, uh, Three years after? Yeah, before we got married. Before kami nagpakasal. Pero I didn't really ask him no, kung ready na siya or what. Parang we just thought of, it's about time. So na feel lang namin na, na ay, pakasal na tayo, gano'n. Push! But I really didn't ask him na, ready ka na bang magpakasal? Walang gano'n. Uh, we all, hindi naman tayo, parang we want, uh, can we talk about marriage? At ginawa din natin yun. Pero we didn't really ask each other na, hoy, ready ka na ba? Parang, parang natural na lang. Yung parang yeah. napag-usapan na lang natin na, Yes, doon na tayo. Parang, oh, let's talk about marriage. Oh, so, yung gagawin natin, di ba? I think we checked a lot of box kasi na we're both of the right age. We're both right. having our own income. We're both, um, we both want to settle down. So, uh, we felt like we both were on the same page. So, let's go. Push. Correct. So, yun. Hindi mo lapit na. Second to the last question. What do I do that makes you the happiest? Butterfly kisses every time. <laughs> oh, lagi niya akong nag-challenge siya nag-ask ng ganun. Well, even if I don't he ask, is, ganun. Uh, minsan, you know, ask, he's like, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> <laughs> Ikaw yun, hindi ako. <laughs> <laughs> I love how lambing you are to me and you baby baby me because ganun talaga personality ko. And, uh, tawag niya sa akin, Mimim. Yeah. I think it's important for couples to know uh, each other's uh, needs and also um, each other's love language and to fulfill each other's love language para maramdaman yung love. Ako mahilig talaga akong ganun eh. Yes. How... Important is it for individuals in a relationship to maintain their own separate identity? Ay, that's very true, no? Hindi ko kasi, that's very important. Kasi hindi mo naman pwedeng i-force yung isang individual na kung anong gusto mo maging siya. Gets mo? Parang, you you enter into a relationship, tilanggap mo siya wholly, whole, na kung sino man siya, pagka yung yung uh, perf- uh, yung imperfection niya lahat, ba diba? So, hindi mo pwedeng i-enforce sa kanya na dapat ganito ka or ganyan ka. So, kagaya niya, artist siya. So, pinapabayaan ko siya, no? Kung ano man yung personality niya, yung attitude niya, ganyan. And because that's part of him na tinanggap ko. And I, I don't think I have the right, no, na i-impose sa kanya kung anong dapat naging sino siya. Parang gano'n. Yeah. And you, ha- you, both partners should encourage each other to uh, grow individually kung ano yung line niya, yes. kung ano yung kanyang hilig, at ano yung mga skill set niya, yung mga strengths niya. In, uh, push mo dun yung partner mo because both of you should be growing in your own fields. Alright, that's a great, yes. some great insights there and definitely your experience is something that we want to have also in our lives. So, just a final questions for you both. Uh, if you could choose your partner again, would you choose the same person? Yes! yes. Oh, somebody! Yeah. <laughs> <Yes. All right. laughs> Happy Pride! Diba? It's June, it's Pride Month. So, I think um, David and I decided to, you know, have create this channel because as a couple in the LGBTQ plus community, we wanted to kind of like somehow inspire and deliver a message you know, to the community that there's nothing wrong yeah. with who we are, who you are, right? Um, I think that... Um, and I think also the message is that you can live fulfilling lives and you can yes. you can grow as a person when you have someone who accepts you Correct. fully, wholly. Especially if you have friends and family who accept you. Yes. Mas na-achieve mo yung potential mo. Actually, yung, yung, yung nagustuhan ko sa relationship namin na both our families are very supporting of us. So, that's very important. Mm. Ano bang message mo? I love you. Ah. <laughs> I love you too. <laughs>